expanding vocabulary with synonyms, antonyms, and feedback. Hello, word explorers. Welcome to another session of our advanced vocabulary series. Today, we're going to talk about a crucial aspect of vocabulary expansion, incorporating feedback from peers and instructors. This interactive process can significantly boost your learning progress, so let's jump right in. When you're expanding your vocabulary with synonyms and antonyms, feedback is a golden tool. It not only points out your mistakes, but also provides insight into other possible choices of words you might not have thought of. Remember, every person you interact with has a unique vocabulary set, and learning from each other enriches your own. Feedback from peers can come in various forms. Maybe they offer a synonym you never considered, or perhaps they suggest a more nuanced antonym to express contrast. The key is being open to these suggestions. Create a shared document or a vocabulary notebook where peers can add their inputs. This way, you can compare and discuss different vocabulary choices. Instructors can provide more structured feedback, grounded in their expertise and teaching experience. They can provide clarifications on meanings, usage, connotations, and much more. Be proactive in asking for their advice and don't shy away from discussing your choices of synonyms or antonyms. It's through these discussions you can really deepen your understanding of English vocabulary. Once you've received feedback, don't just stop there. Implementing it is equally important. Revise your vocabulary lists with the new words or phrases you've learned. Use these new words in your conversations or writings. The more you use them, the more they become part of your active vocabulary. And that's a wrap for today's lesson. Remember, learning is a journey, and every feedback, be it from peers or instructors, is a step forward on this journey. So, embrace it, incorporate it, and let it guide your vocabulary expansion. Until next time, keep exploring the wonder of words.